Hey what's up guys, it's me here, the and this is Windows 10 build 10,051. This build was released late yesterday and includes some new improvements, so let's go ahead it. So build 10,051 introduces the new mail and the calendar app. So if I open up mail here, you will see the app opened up pretty fast and there's the new UI. So the app comes with the basic mailing features and you can reply and yeah, as, as you can see there is the new UI for which looks like the new Metro Office apps and there is the ribbon UI and there is some settings options for the app as well, you can change the background for the app and there is quick actions which basically are just quick gesture, gestures which does not work for a mouse users, a desktop users, it only works for touch users. So you can also add multiple accounts for so for example you can add Exchange Office 365 IMAP and Google accounts. It does not allow you to add iCloud just yet, but I think they are gonna let you add the iCloud mail in the future. So the build also comes comes with a new app called Calendar. Basically they have redesigned it. As you can see, there's the new design which looks much better than the Windows 8.1 version. And as you can see, you can also expand the uh, sidebar with a with by clicking the hamburger button on the top top right and there is some settings app uh, settings for the calendar app as well. You can also sync other accounts. So for example if you have the Google account the app is gonna sync your calendar with the Google Calendar app, Google Calendar items so that's a plus as well. Now Cortana does not add the reminders to your calendar so I'm not sure if, if it doesn't work right now but I'm, I think they they're gonna add it in the future. So this build does not include any other new huge improvements. So there's the new there's a new app called Microsoft Family which does not work right now. As you can see, there's the old people live live people and that's basically the app does not work right now. And Project Spartan has some new features. So if I open up Spartan here, you will see that there's the old Spartan and there's a new option to open it Internet Explorer. So if I click that, it just will open that thing on that web page. So for example, if I go on Double Empower User and if I go on Double Empower User and oh, click there, it should open up. It should open up that web page on Internet Explorer. And as you can see, it opened up Internet Explorer, but I'm not sure why it opens up feedback and reporting like it in that. But I think it's just a bug. Now, Spartan has also picked up another feature, the download manager seems to work on this build, it didn't work on Windows 10 build 10.049, but it works right now, but the history does not work yet, and there is the old reading list for that. So that's basically it for Windows 10 build 10.051, if you have enjoyed it, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe, and yeah, thanks for watching.